Welcome back to Big Daddy's Barbecue Pit. Today, we're going to do some steelhead trout on the pellet grill. We're going to just season it lightly with some olive oil and some seasoning I picked up at my local butcher shop and throw it on the grill for about 15, 20 minutes until it's done. Stick around. So what we're gonna start with first is just some olive oil. We're gonna spray it on real light, rub it in, and then we'll start with our seasonings. So if I try to rub it in, make sure that it gets, hits all of the fish. Uh, I'm doing it today on some cedar planks that I'd soaked for about an hour. Uh, that way they don't burn, they don't burn too bad. Uh, we're just gonna sprinkle some salt, pepper, and garlic on them. This is real simple. I'm also gonna add some uh, fin and fish seafood seasoning I picked up yesterday at my local butcher. Shout out to Wilkes Meat. Thanks all the guys down there for everything they, they helped me out with. Uh, we're gonna try this seasoning today on this uh, steelhead trout, see how it works. I don't want to really use a whole lot. I, I want to just cover it lightly. Uh, I don't want to over, overpower completely the, the taste of the fish. So we're going to throw this on our pellet grill, about 350. It should take somewhere around 15, 20 uh, to get it done completely. I, I have it in, uh, right now it's running at about 350 with cherry pellets in it. So we'll see what it looks like here. So we got the pellet grill rocking along about 350. Uh, we're going to set these on, try to keep them spaced out a little bit, get the air flowing around them. About 15 minutes from now, we'll check them and see how they look. Stick around. So we've, we've had our uh, steelhead trout on for about 25 minutes. I checked them a little bit ago. They were getting close, so now we're just gonna go ahead and pull these off, and we're gonna let them rest a while, and then we're gonna whip up a uh, uh, asparagus with just some olive oil and a little bit of Montreal steak seasoning on it, and we'll throw that on the grill too as well. We'll get that cooked up. So we're just pulling these off, you can see. They got done nice. Got a real good color. Can't wait to try them. So the next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna take some fresh asparagus. We're gonna put a little olive oil on it. And then we're gonna add some Montreal steak seasoning. Kind of just mix it up. We're gonna go over and put it back on the pellet grill. And we're gonna have this with our steelhead trout. So I just want to try to get it all covered and then I'm going to add some seasoning to it. And then you can just toss it in there. Make sure all of it gets covered real well. And then what I like to do is I just lay this out across the grill grates just until it starts to get tender. So we got everything seasoned up. We got some olive oil on it. We're just gonna put it on here for a short time, get it good and tender. Just kind of spread them out. It's kind of a quick and easy way to cook some fresh vegetables to have with your dinner. These will probably only take about 10 minutes and they'll be tender enough. You don't want to overcook them or let them get too dark. So this asparagus has been on about 15 minutes. We're gonna go ahead and pull it off. You can see it's it's getting really limp. Looks good, seasoned up real well. So we're just gonna pull it off and stick it here in a foil pan. So we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna cut our, our steelhead trout. We're gonna plate it up with some of the asparagus. And then we also made a fresh mango salsa that we're gonna put on top of it. We'll post that recipe as well. Uh, 
let's try it out. So you should be able to just pull this fish right back away. You set it on there. We'll put some of this fresh salsa on top with the mangoes like that. And we'll add some asparagus. So the seasoning, like I said before, I, I got, it was called uh, Fin and Fish from Wilkes Meat Market in Swanee, Georgia. Uh, this was basically just salt, pepper, garlic, a little bit of olive oil on it, about a, 25 minutes on the pellet grill. And then we, we seasoned up some asparagus with some uh, Montreal steak seasoning and a little bit of olive oil. So we're gonna go ahead and, and try this steelhead trout with the salsa on it. Falls right apart. Get a little taste of it. Mm. The vegetables bring out a lot of really good freshness in that fish. I recommend anybody try this recipe. Again, you could probably use any basic seasoning on it. Got my seasoning from down at my local uh, fish or uh, meat market. Let's try one of the vegetables. Mm. Very good. Check this recipe out. Big Daddy's Barbecue Pit.